brazen, has and Meg air dirty laundry in public has stripped royal privacy causing fans blow up. The controversial Oprah Winfrey interview with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex was broadcast on March 8, 2021. The tell-all interview was a retaliation to the accusations made behind the scenes by the royal family. The interview announcement was a surprise for the senior members because it meant less privacy and more pity for the royal household. Andrew Neil, a broadcaster and publisher told Channel 5 Royal Documentary 2021, The Queen's Horrible Year, it came as a huge surprise to the royal family that Harry and Meghan were prepared to do this and to do it with Oprah Winfrey. It surprised, maybe some anger, maybe a little apprehension as well that they were giving this interview because not only had they cut loose and seemed to want their own thing in California but they were gonna wash their dirty linen in public. Princess Olga Romanoff, Queen's third cousin said, it was much better when the monarch was more of mystique. There is less privacy, and I think for their sake, that's a pity. Harry and Meghan accused a member of the royal family, not the Queen or Duke of Edinburgh, of racism in shocking claims made during their Oprah Winfrey interview earlier this year. Meghan said, when she was pregnant with Archie, an unnamed member of the royal family raised concerns and conversations about how dark his skin might be when he's born. Asked whether there were concerns that her child would be too brown and that would be a problem, the Duchess said, if that is the assumption you are making, that is a pretty safe one. Pushed by Winfrey on who had those conversations, Meghan refused to say, adding, I think that would be very damaging to them. Harry refused to give further details, adding, that conversation, I am never going to share. At the time it was awkward, I was a bit shocked. Clarence House has since dismissed as fiction claims in a new book The Prince of Wales was the royal who speculated on the skin color of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's future children. American author Christopher Anderson alleges in his book Charles made the comment on the day Harry and Meghan's engagement was announced in November 2017. In Anderson's book, Brothers and Wives, Inside the Private Lives of William, Kate, Harry, and Meghan, he writes the prince said to the Duchess of Cornwall I wonder what the children will look like. The New York Post's page 6 website reported. When Camilla replied well, absolutely gorgeous, I'm certain, the book claims Charles went on to say I mean, what do you think their children's complexion might be? A Clarence House spokesman said this is fiction and not worth further comment. Former U.S. President Donald Trump accused Meghan Markle of using Prince Harry and said he hasn't been a fan of hers since day one in a GB News interview with Nigel Farage on Tuesday. Trump, Markle, and Harry have a long-standing rift. While starring on Suits in 2016, Markle made an appearance on the The Nightly Show with Larry Wilmore where she called the then Republican presidential candidate divisive and misogynistic, before sharing her support for Hillary Clinton. Her comments were brought to Trump's attention during his presidential tenure in 2019 in an interview with UK newspaper The Sun. He told the interviewer he didn't know she was nasty. Trump later told Piers Morgan in June 2019 that he wasn't referring to her as she's nasty, I said she was nasty about me. And essentially, I didn't know she was nasty about me. Trump made his feelings about the Duchess of Sussex clear in his interview on Tuesday by telling right-wing British politician Farage that the Duke of Sussex has been used horribly by Markle. I'm not a fan of hers. I wasn't from day one. I think Harry has been used horribly and I think someday he will regret it, Trump said. I think it's ruined his relationship with his family, and it hurts the Queen. Trump went on to say he thought the Duchess of Sussex lobbying members of Congress using Duchess of Sussex headed paper was very inappropriate. 